today. Morning to you. Hope you slept well. The Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Got a little bit of that lifter tap going on. And I happen to get some of this stuff in. So I said, why not? Give it a couple minutes and let's see where we're at. A little bit more. I still hear it. You can hear it right there. Well, it's been a couple minutes. I still hear it. So, anyway. So, some of you have been asking me to try Pro Lube out. I did try Pro Lube out. I got one shipment in and I uh, seen some people testing it some kind of unconventional way. They were like, oh, let me pick a high mileage engine. And if it's like a six quart system, I'll put six ounces of Pro Lube in there. And they did. And all of a sudden the water bottle that was half full that was sitting on top of the um, engine, the water went from being real choppy to kind of real smooth, just barely moving. And I was like, so this is how people are testing this stuff now. This is comical. So I went and found uh, the Dodge Ram at 187,000 miles. It never smoothed out with that. Then I went and got a Toyota Avalon with 270,000 miles on it. Poured some Pro Lube in that while it was running. Never smoothed out. Running or hot, it was the same way. So um, I, I couldn't verify it by the way some other people were testing and then I needed some more so I had a subscriber on TikTok that was kind enough to send me the Pro Lube uh, a bigger thing of Pro Lube so I can test more and I just threw it in the engine just now when you get that lifter tick here on these AFM engines it'll do that that real like tap 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 eventually after driving it a while it goes away on its own but this being going from cold to warm 
didn't make a difference. It just kept tapping. It didn't get in there and make anything quieter like all these other guys are saying, oh, put the pro lube in my Chevy and my AFM. A cold start got better and it idled better and stuff. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not against pro lube. I want pro lube to work for me and I want pro lube to work for you guys. But I'm not seeing it so far with what has been claimed. So what I did was I ordered a professional bearing tester. The same ones that Project Farm uses, the same one that, that test labs and stuff use for their wear analysis and stuff. I ordered one. It cost me $1,000 to order this thing. So if you guys want to donate, I'll stick my link down below. Uh, there was one person that donated already. He threw 50 bucks my way and said, that's a lot of money, man. I, I'd, I'd like to participate towards that. And uh, he threw 50 bucks my way. It's just my email is what my PayPal is. Um, and he said, what you should do is you should let your subscribers participate because that is a lot of money for somebody to come out of pocket. So I spent $1,000 on one machine and I turned around and spent another $500 on another machine. So we have two machines going. One will be here at the end of the month. The other one won't get here until like mid-January because there's only a limited supply available. So I have the bearing testing machines coming that ProLube uses in their videos to actually test their bearings. Um, I have tagged ProLube in several of my videos on TikTok and they blessed off on the testing that I'm doing. They have been in communication with me saying that they hope it works out for me. Uh, that, that any kind of testing that I could do to show their product, they're definitely in support of. Uh, because they have nothing to hide, you know. So they've been very supportive of me talking about testing their stuff independently. And I am not paid by them. They're not giving me any money. Nobody's giving me any money. But I think what we'll do is we'll roll this over into oil testing as well. And we'll see which oils actually lubricate the best. And that'll, that, that'll be a winter project for us to keep going throughout the winter. Because there's a lot of oils to try. So, I thought that would be pretty cool. What do y'all think? Anyhow, I uh, appreciate it. And uh, we will be further testing ProLoop. Thank you. Be blessed.